Welcome back. We're going to talk about device configuration profiles in Microsoft Endpoint Manager for Mac OS. And in this example, we're going to talk about pushing out Wi-Fi to those Mac devices. So here I am inside Microsoft Endpoint Manager. And from the main home screen, we're going to click on Devices. And then we're going to click on Configuration Profiles and Create Profile. Choose your platform and then choose your type of profile and we chose Wi-Fi. Now I've already done this and right here is where I've already created one. Now this is using what I would consider a personal uh, Wi-Fi configuration or basic where I'm including my SSID, I'm telling it to connect automatically, I'm telling it to use uh, WPA2 as the security type and then I'm giving it my pre-shared key. That's you know, a very basic one. Now, what this will look like once I assign it to someone. So let me just show you here. I have it assigned to all users and all devices. And again, the system is smart enough to know to assign it only to Macs and not Windows PCs or other types of devices. If I go on my Mac here to System Preferences and pull up my uh, networking preferences and go to Wi-Fi and click on Advanced, there is Sosman Corp the Wi-Fi profile that got pushed down. So that's how that works. Now, you're probably wondering, what if I use a more of an enterprise uh, Wi-Fi setup? Well, that's okay too. So let's go ahead and create a profile and we're gonna choose Mac OS and for Wi-Fi is our profile type and we're gonna call this uh, Mac OS Enterprise Wi-Fi. And under configuration settings, we're going to choose enterprise and we'll call this Sysmin Corp, Sysmin Enterprise and connect automatically. Sure, why not? I'm going to choose my EAP type. So depending on the type, you will get configuration parameters here that are appropriate. Um, I also have certificate uh, parameters as well since uh, PEEP uses certificate based authentication. Uh, I've got my options for LEAP, obviously different types of options. So that's how I would push out an enterprise level Wi-Fi profile. Now, if it's a profile that is enterprise based and it's using something like PEEP or EAP that requires a certificate, we would need to create another profile to push out that certificate. I will do another video all about certificates, so stay tuned for that. But this is how you push out a Wi-Fi profile for Mac OS using Microsoft Endpoint Manager. If you found value, let me know. Give me a thumbs up. Be sure to subscribe because we're going to post a lot more videos about Mac OS and Endpoint Manager. If you didn't find value, let me know in the comments. Give me some feedback. All right, folks, we'll see you in the next video. Take care.